and knock a little bit. Crap. Oh, this is literally a long track. No! Oh, I'm so lucky. Okay, okay, okay. So. So. Boom. <coughs> Boom. E bike on. Let's go. Okay, okay. Here we go. So this is the trail we've been shooting on earlier for the video shoot so gonna get down this one little warm up it's pretty cold actually I'm just wearing like a Montserrat racing jersey and then the body warmer over it but my arms are pretty Cool. Ugh. Just gonna do some chill laps today, so just gonna enjoy the riding. Holy moly, it's so slick. This is new. Wow! Holy moly. I was so uncomfortable this bit. It's so hard to spot what's underneath. Like you can't see anything. And all of a sudden you get pinched left and right. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Well, that was fun. It's so hard to spot what's underneath though. If you're leaning into a corner, it just leaves all in it. And there's like, if there's like one rock in it, you can just get pinched over the berm like nothing. And it kills your confidence, so. Really need to pay attention when riding here, but yeah, I'm just gonna do some flow laps today. Nothing, nothing uh, on race space or whatever. So, in the search for a trail I haven't ridden in years. Ah, there it is. So there always used to be a trail over there, right there, but that one's closed. And this one. I always rode the one up top, but I always forgot about this one. I can't really remember what it was like, but I only know I think there was very tight trees at the bottom. So I guess we'll figure it out. Oh, there. 
up hill. That's pretty cool. Getting extra long trail. That's pretty cool. Big rut. This is such a sick trail. Holy okay, that was easily rideable. Good thing I do have an e bike, so I can just do a little uphill stage over here. It's always scary with those blind jumps because you like. I kind of want to send it, but then sometimes you don't do it and then you look afterwards and there's like a huge stump or something. Feeling a bit stiff, but hey ho. Oh. Yeah, so this is the bit. Look at, look at how tight this is. This is crazy tight. <laughs> oh, that was, that's such a good trail. I don't know why I've never ridden that one. That's, with the uphill and everything, that's amazing. Just a lot of leaves right now, but now I'm going up on this hill on the right. So there's like three hills, I think, or even four. And, uh, just going to the middle one now to do it is uh, to do one of the trails there because they are very much fun. We're back at the top, and we're gonna do one of the legendary tracks over here. This is a very cool one as well, but. First we're going a bit more down this side. So this is the trail with this little natural half pipe kind of thing in it. So excited to see how that's shaped up right now. Oh, it's very rocky over here. Here it is. Whoa! Holy moly! How much leaves was that? That was crazy. Whoa! So hard to see where you need to go. It's crazy. Holy moly! Whoa! Holy sh! You can't see anything. Look at that. Holy moly! And it can't break either because of all the leaves. It's literally just drifting. So crazy. I think I might need some dirty dance. Oh, my hand hurt quite a bit. Just get my knuckle on it. Lesson learned. Watch out for the big leaf patches. Cause that's, that's wild. So I'm just gonna change the width of the hand guards just to make them a bit wider I shouldn't be hitting my knuckles on the trees if I have these hand guards on here yeah? so maybe I should just swap them around and then uh, should be better hopefully yeah I reckon so we got the hand guards a bit more wide as you can see here and here as well as you can tell Hit my knuckle a little bit so hopefully that should be better 
like one of those those crashes where or crashes like mistakes where it doesn't look like much but it kind of hurts quite a lot so yeah that's me right now just stupidly hit a tree with your fist but then it hurts quite a lot on hill number three So many loose rocks, crazy. Wow. I'm just wheel spinning up in here. And we're back to it again. So last time I was here, I did another trail that I wanted to do. Holy moly, it looks like a big storm has been here. Um, but I'm gonna keep my eyes out and check that I'm going for the right one. Okay, okay, okay. Okay, eyes open, Tristan. Ah, here it is. This is the track I meant to ride. Looks like a lot of people haven't. It doesn't really look like a lot of people rode, it, rode this one. Yes, this is it. This is it. Wow, oh, this looks very abandoned. How do people not know this trail? Oh, oh. So this is this is the track everyone's in. That's well fun. <laughs> Looks like no one rides that track. It's just crazy because that one is one of the f most fun ones. Always wanted to know what's down on this hill. But I've never been there because I didn't want to waste my energy going somewhere and then finding a trail. But since I'm on the e-bike, I can just check it out. Oh, there's definitely a tree over there. That's why I can definitely tell. Okay. That's good to know. So it looks like this is a trail as well, but kind of looks like a walking path too. So I don't think I'm that keen on riding this down if I can just ride it up with my e-bike. But I'm definitely gonna check out that one over there. So I'm keeping my eyes open, but I'm pretty sure it should be somewhere here. So hard to spot now. Oh, that's a top bit of a track. Oh, that's a trail. Holy moly. That's how hard it is to tell where you need to go. Look, here's a trail. Usually you shouldn't be doing this. But, because it's a Tuesday afternoon, it usually should be, should be okay. Well, here it is then. Let's keep our eyes open and try to see where I need to go. Ew. Man, I think it's going here. Yes. Oh, this is literally a long track. Holy. Holy moly. now oh here here it is oh this this is the old track then i got it oh 
Whoa. That is well sketchy. If that thing was not stuck, if that thing was stuck, it would be. Well, that was fun. That was very much fun. Oh, I love e bikes. E bikes are the best. Now, for real, too, to check out trails and stuff and to just ride on your own e-bikes are in my in my opinion the best ever looks like found another trail but i'm not 100 percent sure oh yeah it is a trail so according to trail forks this one should be very long probably very flat but it's definitely a trailhead, that's for sure. Drifting all over the place. This is a sick trail. Looks like this is this is a trail. Holy moly! Looks like I found another trail. Okay. Okay. Ah, maybe this is just the entrance of the trail I was looking for. Yeah, yeah, yeah. These conditions, the mud, the, the hand guards are so good. So it looks like you can do those two trails up there, or one big one, and then the one down there that we that we did when we went to this side. Looks like you can even connect those ones together, which then would make for a pretty, pretty long track. Well, it looks like I found a trail. It's called Klankenhaus Downhill or something, which basically means hospital downhill, which doesn't sound too good, but let's not do as the Sinam says so I also have to pay attention to my battery level because I didn't charge it completely and we're already like three hills away from where the van is so kind of need to watch out a bit with the battery life but we still got two two blocks left so I think if uh, I'm only having one I'm just going to cruise back so let's see what this is like Good, just checking if the GoPro is still on. Wow, this is hectic. Oh, there's a drop over there too, which I missed.
Then jump. Wah. Oh, it looks like the trail continues over here. This is a sick one. So sketchy because I can't stop at all because of the of the leaves. I'm pretty sure I've ridden this one before, but it's been a long time. Back at the top and back at one of my favorite trails that is here. Now we only caught three range, three kilometers range on the e-bike left. So I did quite some good calculations there with how many times I could ride. So I think the only thing is possible is that we're gonna be able to ride this one and then probably head back home Let's get to it, eh? Let's get to it. The valley line. Wow, it's so slick. Wow. Okay, okay, I'm not going into that puddle, that's for sure. <laughs> Whoa. Holy moly. Probably mosquito eh? So lucky. Wow. Okay, I was not lucky there. Holy moly. It's always a mutt fest down here. That was, that's it for today, I reckon. So the e-bike officially ran out of battery. I'm glad I didn't go up again. There she is, the trusty van. <laughs> I haven't sweat all day until the battery ran out and then I was paddling hard to get up this hill. Well, there she is. Canyon Spectra on. It was a pretty pretty good day here in the forest. She held up pretty good. It looks like a good day to me. A lot of leaves in there as well, which is made 
pretty sketchy. Um, but yeah, good day. And the battery ran out of battery too. It says, yeah, it's not working anymore. So yeah, hope you guys enjoyed watching. Hope you guys enjoyed my little commentary as well. Um, made me feel a bit less alone, so that was pretty nice. Well, I uh, hope you guys enjoyed it, and uh, see you guys in the next one. Don't forget to like, by the way, and subscribe. Hate to say it, but it helps the algorithm. So, good. See you guys later. Yo, yo.